This is a prophetic word for Oasis Church given by Julian Adams on Sunday, the 13th of September, 2015. God said to me there's going to be a new cinema, a movie house coming to Howick very soon. God spoke to me. I saw the plans that are being drawn up that are beginning to be designed by a consortium of investors for Howick that is going to mark a new season of economic rejuvenation and redevelopment and influence for the church. And I felt God say to me, This is a season in which he is going to give you a footprint and an influential voice in this region in a significant way. I could literally see God bringing a CBD like a central business district together with significant shops and entertainment places, significant restaurants that are going to act as a hub for a bustle of activity. And when you begin to see this beginning to build, I literally see big machines coming in. When you see this, it will be a sign for significant breakthrough in terms of evangelism and in terms of influence and in terms of growth, not only for this church, but for the churches of Howick. Now, God is going to give you guys an ability to walk into places and get the best of the best in order to see the kingdom of God released. I could really see these plans and schemes of people beginning to make an order to release blessing for you guys. I believe the Lord is going to begin to release even the east of the city, new housing developments, new housing projects that are beginning to up the population stats. Where there was a downturn of population stats, God is going to turn that around. There is going to be an increase of population and migration to this place because of the peace that will be governing this place. There are going to be a lot of people suddenly coming here. I even see schools that are going to be built to accommodate the influx of people that are beginning to come. And you need to get ready for this because God is going to do a significant thing for you. There is a line that has been drawn in the history of this church and the history of this town in order to move you into a new dynamic pioneering that God is going to begin to give you plans, plans that are far-fetched, plans that seem too big. But God says, this is the way I work. And God is going to begin to give you an ability to release this generation of young men and women who will not only move here, but will live and die here because they are going to see the kingdom come in this region. And it is not that this is the last place you will be involved in, but you will start laying the foundation of a platform for others even to take over. And I believe God is going to give you a significant voice in this region. And in this town so that people will listen to you because you are going to have the ability to see the future because your DNA is prophetic. And there is going to be a futuristic ability in what you do and what you say in order to see where God wants to move. God is going to raise up this community as an apostolic people that are going to be trained up and released in many different spheres and many different ways. I believe the Lord is really going to release a profound creativity that will touch the nations from this place. There is a dynamic of creativity that is inherent in the soil of this region, and God is going to begin to unlock. There will be some famous artists that will come from this region that will begin to create a context where others will come and be trained and released, and they will encounter God on the way. And God wants to say to you that he will give you a voice that will cut across the new age. You will not be afraid of it, but you will walk headlong into different communities and release the power of the kingdom of God. Some of the wildest, funniest, oddest people are going to find themselves at home in this community. God is going to give you incredible favor. And God says to you that he has the habit of taking that which seems small, and insignificant and making it great and powerful. And God is going to take what seems like a small town, what seems like an insignificant town in the economy of KwaZulu-Natal and make it very significant. And you are to get ready because he's shaping some of those things in you. The Lord also wants to say that the things that are written down in your journal, the things that you began to think about in the next five years in particular, God, if I write these goals down, maybe they will happen. They seem all a little bit out of reach, but just achievable. And God says, I'm going to multiply them and I'm going to break through the ceiling of that five-year plan, all right? Because I have more for you. And there is going to be a holy acceleration in your ability to communicate and release the kingdom of God. And I feel that God wants to say to you as a church that you will be known for his presence. You will be known because of the presence of God will be on you in a very powerful way. And you will need to get ready because the Lord is reshaping some things. The Lord is also going to give you property as a church. I see three property bases 
in the church that God is about to open up. I feel one is going to do with hospitality, entertainment and coffee bars and food and places where people come and get ready and go out. Another is an orphanage, and I believe the Lord has spoken to the church about an orphanage. I see plans. I think there are some architectural plans lying around somewhere, and God is pulling them out because I see a home in the city center, as it were, that is going to host young children and love on them and bring them into a place of wholeness. And there is going to be an incredible anointing for adoption across the color line in this church. You will see a lot of this happening in the church, so get ready. God is going to do something very significant. The third building I see is a building that is going to be like a house of restoration and healing. Like a restoration house, actually, where people come, particularly people on the verge of breakdowns, on the verge of nervous breakdowns, on the verge of losing it all. You get to speak into their lives and freedom is going to come. There is going to be a healing room that is going to be established. It is going to be a well that is opened up in this region and is going to set you up as the center of seeing signs and wonders as a church. And you can get ready for that because God's hand is on you in a significant, significant way. The Lord says that the ceiling of limitations financially is going to break. So you can start to do the things that are on your heart in terms of the dreams and the things that you know God has spoken to you about. It is like you have been confident and happy to live with what you have, but God says there is an increase coming financially. I see some businessmen and women who say they want to bless you over and above your salary because God wants to do something significant with you guys in terms of your ability to increase other towns and cities. There is going to be an opportunity for translocal flow to begin to happen because of how he is going to bless you in this next season. So you are going to get ready because God is going to break through the ceilings of limitations because it is a new day for you guys.